Hey, so it's late. It's like 11.51 and I didn't post a video for yesterday. Um, so I'm posting one poem right now and then I'm going to write another poem quickly and post another one. Um, this one I just wrote. Um, and yeah, I think I'm just going to read it and then maybe explain it a bit afterwards. Um, I guess I'll just probably call this one Monsters. There are monsters synchronized swimming in all my double helixes, and I am afraid of them. Because no amount of scratching or pulling or biting will remove them from my skin. There are shadows here snoozing in the bend of my elbow, waiting, biding their time. And my worst fear is that they will ask me to choose. A vampiric need for another drink, a giant blob of morphing cells, a zombie-like forgetfulness, or a Frankenstein's monster heartbreak. The worst fear is not that there are monsters, it's that they're all waiting for me to choose which I will become. Um, so I guess that's kind of about um, heredity, which kind of sounds scientific compared to, you know, monsters. Um, there, I mentioned a couple of monsters, uh, a vampiric need for another drink, obviously vampires, you know, need blood to survive. and. Um, a lot of people in my family uh, are alcoholics, so, you know, in the same way, they kind of need a drink to survive. Um, a giant blob of morphing cells, obviously cancer, a zombie-like forgetfulness, Alzheimer's, or Frankenstein's monster heartbreak. By the way, Frankenstein's monster, please actually read Frankenstein because Frankenstein's monster is the most, like, heartbreaking uh, individual ever. Um, in the book, he doesn't want to hurt anyone. He's actually like a really beautiful human being inside, but um, he knows that there's no one else like him on the planet. Um, and eventually, though, they don't show the suicide. Um, it says that he uh, commits suicide basically because he is um, heartbroken at uh, all the people he's hurt, and he's even more heartbroken that there's nobody else to share um, his solitude, I guess. So, um, that has to do with suicide, which runs in my family. Also, um, dying of a broken heart, which also runs in my family. Um, so I guess this poem is just basically about, like, the constant fear of becoming everyone else in your family and, like, seeing... The amount of pain other people are in and knowing that statistically you could be there in a few years um so yeah i guess it's just kind of about fear so anyway that's my spiel for right now and as i said i'm gonna write another poem quick and post it um but technically this is still sort of on time it's 11:54 right now so bam all right night